So this is a bit of a disclaimer as of right now. Um, I got a lot of products for Christmas um, that were basically cleaning supplies and they were not, you know, what's the word, sustainable products. And I'm getting some products that are non-sustainable right now to clean up my apartment, but honestly, that's because it's in bad shape. And, you know, I, I really need right now, um, because I don't really have ready access to the powerful stuff that's sustainable, um, because of my budgetary constraints and whatnot. I don't really have the, the, uh, availability of it. So what I'm doing right now is cleaning everything up real good. And once that's done, I'm going to... Really look into trying to do a vinegar and baking soda and maybe a little bit of bleach on certain surfaces to uh, work on cleaning in a more sustainable manner. But uh, yeah, it's not exactly the cleanest thing to do, of course, but um, yeah, clean everything up slowly. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's just a little disclaimer. I'm not completely going green right now, but, you know, sometimes you got to do a fresh start before you can really do anything good. Anything well, I should say. So, I'm really working on cleaning everything up in my apartment. Once it's completely clean, uh, then I can really work on going, um, going more green, going more zero waste. But, as of right now, I've got to make that clean, fresh start, and... Once that's done, um, start from the beginning. As of right now, I've still got my heater at 60 degrees. Uh, so it's kind of chilling here, but I wear um, sweatpants and whatnot in the apartment to keep myself warm. Um, I've got some water, a jug of water out here. Um, gonna get more water than that because, for one thing, it's an emergency water supply. Um, also, it serves to hold heat in the apartment more so um still working on becoming more zero waste but <sighs> yep gotta make that fresh start gonna clean everything up and then once everything's cleaned up gotta go and make that fresh start and uh stick with me